Well, first visit here for a while. I've been in Wales, and uh, I see they've destroyed all the willows around the edge of the pond. It's a bit of a shame because it gave a bit of cover for the uh, reed warblers and sedge warblers when they arrive. That's really, I don't know, I don't understand it. They nest along there. It did give them a bit of cover, but there you go. I guess the parks trust know best. Well, the willows are cut right the way around. I don't know why they don't go the whole hog and just burn the fucking reeds. A big group of red wing have just flown in that bush, there's one of them. Make the most of it, lads. I'll probably chop them down next. It's nice to see the uh, white blossom coming through on some of the trees. It's on a spring. There's no sign of any uh, heron under the footbridge or little egret. But there is a song thrush singing away quite heartily. Just up the top of that. Uh, just at the crucial moment, the battery decided to go, but uh, here we are. Some more management down there. I don't know why they didn't do something useful like move this bloody tree that's been down like this for god knows how long. I suppose that involves a bit of work, doesn't it? Too hard. There's a great spotted woodpecker drumming up there. Maybe I should get this tree cut down and stop all that nonsense. Take the lot down. There's another one drumming across there. But, uh, this one's just sitting on top of the lamppost. Well, at least I ain't dug up these crocuses, not yet, anyway. And by way of contrast, there's a green woodpecker. Bunting.
and a few potted. And a few tufted duck. Well, down towards the rowing club. Almost done. And there's a couple of uh, naughty fishermen up there that are fishing where they shouldn't be. Hello. And we are making our way back to the car park, full circuit. Now the sun decides to come out. Bloody typical.